Hello guys welcome back to another After Effects tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to make modern glitch opener animation. Let's have a look. You can download complete project from below link in the description. You just need to replace the images I have used with your own images or video. You can also use this as glitch logo opening animation. So let's start. Create a new composition. Import your image to project. Add it to the timeline. If your image is large then you need to scale it. Press S to bring up scales. Scale it to fit the composition. Now we need to pre-compose our image. Let's name it as picture. Now we are going to completely work on the adjustment layer. It does not affect your picture or its composition. Create a new adjustment layer. In effects and presets search to transform. Add it to adjustment layer 1. Create a keyframe for the anchor point. Set values to 1640. Go 2 seconds forward and set values to 2060. Press U to views keyframes. Select keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Adjust the speed graph. Go back to start of the timeline. Create a keyframe for position. Set values to minus 749. Go 12 frames forward set values to 2060. Come back to start of the timeline. Create a keyframe for scale. Set values to 170. Go 2 seconds and 12 frames forward set values to 100. Press U to views keyframes. Select all keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Adjust the speed graph for position. In effects and presets search for mosaic. Add it to adjustment layer 1. Create a keyframe for the vertical block. Set value to 1. Go 20 frames forward. Set value to 240. Make sure you have checked the shape colors. Select keyframes and change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Come back to start of the timeline. Press Alt and click on the stopwatch of horizontal blocks. In the expression change value 1 to 0002. In effects and presets search for minimax. Add it to adjustment layer 1. Come back to start of the timeline. Create a keyframe for radius. Set value to 276. Go 1 second and 4 frames forward and set the value to 0. Select keyframes and change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Change channel color to alpha and color. Change direction to just horizontal. In effects and presets search for find edges. Add it to adjustment layer 1. Come back to start of the timeline. Make sure you have checked the invert checkbox. Create a keyframe for bend with original. Go 1 second and 12 frames forward and set the value to 100. This is what we have got it so far. Create a new adjustment layer. In effects and presets search for cartoon. Add it to adjustment layer 2. Change render to fill. 
change softness to 10. In effects and presets search for find edges. Add it to adjustment layer 2. In effects and presets search for minimax. Add it to adjustment layer 2. Change operation to maximum than minimum. Set the radius to 65. Change direction to just horizontal. In effects and presets search for displacement map. Add it to adjustment layer 2. Change use for horizontal displace to luminance. Change use for vertical displace to luminance. Change value to minus 4250. Create a keyframe for max horizontal displacement. Go 12 seconds forward. Change value to minus 510. Go 1 second 12 frames forward and change the value to 0. Create a new adjustment layer. In effects and presets search for linear wipe. Add it to adjustment layer. Create a keyframe for the transaction and make sure value is set to 0. Go 1 second 12 frames forward and change the value to 100. In effects and presets search for turbulent displace. Add it to adjustment layer. Set displacement to horizontal displacement. Change amount to 10,000. Change size to. Change complexity to 10. Create a keyframe for pinning. Go 12 frames forward. Change pinning to pin left. For adjustment layer 2, change track mat to luma mat adjustment layer 3. Select all layers and pre-compose it. Name it as animate. Now create a new solid. In effects and presets search for circle. Add it to the solid layer. Create a keyframe for the center. Set value to minus 1800. Radius to 1770. Edge to thickness radius. Change thickness to 35. In effects and presets search for turbulent displace. Add it to the solid layer. Change displacement to horizontal displacement. Change amount to 6970. Size to 11. Change pinning to none. Again add turbulent displace. Change amount to 137. Change size to 260. Complexity to 10. In effects and presets search for grid, add it to the solid layer. Change blending mode to stencil alpha. Change size form to width and height sliders. Change width to 25. Now pre-compose the solid layer. Name it as FX. Again pre-compose it. Open the FX Comp 1. Add the animate composition. Select both composition and press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate. Bring them above the FX composition. Change both animate composition track mat to luma mat FX. Come back to FX composition 1. In effects and presets search for tint. Add it to the composition. Change the color. In effects and presets search for glow. Add it to the composition.
Change glow threshold to 70. Change glow intensity to 20. Now select FX Composition 1. Press Ctrl plus D to create duplicate, change color. Again create a duplicate. Remove tint and glow effects. Now select above layer. Change mode to add. Change mode of below layers to overlay. Create a new adjustment layer. In effects and presets search for calculations. Add it to the adjustment layer. Search for exposure. Add it to the adjustment layer. Search for curves. Add it to the adjustment layer. Adjust the curve in the form of S. Adjust the curve in the form of S. Create a new solid. Make sure its color is set to black. View the title action safe. And draw the mask over the solid layer. Change mode to subtract. And here your modern glitch opener is ready. Thank you for watching. If you have any query or question you are free to comment below. If you like this tutorial then don't forget to hit that like button. And if you are new here then don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.